Good morning to you. Anywhere you are watching me from, may God bless you as you are tuning in. This is Linda's TV show. Here we bring information across the globe. We educate, inform the members of the public. If this is the kind of content you like, please kindly subscribe. Put on your notification bell to all notification. It will enable you to know when we upload a new video. I put a disclaimer that here in Linda's TV show, we do not preach misleading information. We do not preach hate speech. We do not preach violence. I don't love things. I will never promote them here. We do not instigate war or violence. And a call for self-determination is never a call for war. And I want to seize this opportunity to appreciate you two for creating and allowing us to use their platform to disseminate information to the members of the image of uh, Uru Agons. Upon Tuchibuzeguato is analyzing a kidnapping that happened in Unizik. And in that kidnapping, he said, No one who got in here, Neku, no burn and didn't matter that all law, a kidnap or her. But I want to ask you upon Tuchibuzeguato, the guy. That reported the case of a teacher, man like this, that we are teacherizing him, and you negotiated price to them. Are you against these particular people because they are not from your own group of Ndoshi, Ndi, or are you not just genuinely against them? Because the people that have reported to you, Abinishu, I used to say it. You negotiated price to them. Instead of you telling the man or reporting to police as you said or reporting to Ndani as you said because you said that Ndani and the police is there to save our people. You went and negotiated the price for them and tell the man to go and pay them. <laughs> Let us go please. Let us go towards your name please let us go and analyze the nonsense uh, please pay very close attention He said why he kept quiet since it happened to know more Kwandimburu. So he see a kidnapping taking shape in broad daylight and he kept quiet to know more Kwandimburu. But what Chibuzo is telling you is that he kept quiet to know if these are his team that did it. Chibuzo, why you were in Nigeria to bury one and you agree? In the cancer buru. The one and you agree, I'm called Newi, that EGG of Newi gave Butere cancer. Why you were there to bury her? May her soul rest in Ogiri Obey. You were in Nigeria. As in Nigeria, you we are in Biafra land, the former Eastern Nigeria. You bought guns. Why you we are still enjoying police escort, a bubago escort, military escort? You bought guns for some criminals in Imo State. I got the information correctly. You bought guns for some criminals in Imo State, and here you are telling the people. That you kept quiet when this kidnapping happened to make sure. But what you are not telling the people is that you want to verify your team to ask them. You once negotiated a ransom of 3 million. Please remember, the guy reached out to me. 
you negotiated a ransom of 30 million. The guy himself confessed to me, the guy that paid you people the money, confessed it to me that Chibuz or Eguato negotiated ransom for some group of criminals, 3 million Nigerian Naira. So he is telling you people that he kept quiet since so many. You know when they speak like this, they confuse you. He kept quiet since so many to make sure of Kwandimburu. But what he is not telling you is that he kept quiet since so many to verify him of his own group that did it. And I have heard that there are breakaways in his group. In Chibuze Eguato's group, there are breakaways. Some people have left his criminal enterprise. Bata, bata. Why some people have left to start their own? Like I had last, the brother of Ikonsu is no longer with them. He doesn't uh, participate in the criminality. But according to the information given to me here, I told them that I want to speak to him. Unless he, I speak to him, he is still part of the criminal enterprise. Upon Tuluago narrated that he sent him a bit of Baba Yebe, Yabrukwe AK 47, bit of Baba Nda. So he must tell us how he got hold of the AK 47, which is Abandiba Nosa Naba Yebe, according to Upon Tuluago. You cannot be coming to a line to be shouting security, security, security. And you are the one, the, the one coordinating the kidnapping. As you see him confess in this very video, he kept quiet since so many. Many of you don't know what he's saying. To make a show, that means to make sure this is not my team that did it, it is another team. And immediately after he finished speaking to his team, no, no, but they go also for ransom. I heard the video on a trend. I don't want to talk about it because it's a monoma. Why didn't you video the man? And they told him, Senior man, I am a quite We don't know what you are saying. He said, Do you not mean, do you mean that it is not your people that did that thing at the Unisic back gate? I have people that monitor your people very well who tell me the truth. And they say, senior man, we did not do it. And Obuntu Uruago came out to announce. Oh, look at what is happening. Everyone and the mother. Obuntu Uruago, but you negotiated ransom. I am not about million on the You negotiated ransom. A guy held ransom. You negotiated ransom between him and kidnappers. And he is not even the one that gave you the number of the kidnappers. He told you, should I give you their number? You asked him, where did they do it to you? He narrated the area. You said, don't worry, I have their number. Which means, you have the number of the areas that kidnappers operate. And the reason why you choose to talk about this particular one is because it was not done by your team. Am I communicating, please? Let us please go on. On a matter of Uncota Corre, go to your co happy decatur yaro. Let us go. An umbra seat, and the money you see, setting card and an umbra, they are what are the associate? They wound the mud, or the man, and the poor half, or the people half, or where are the police, or where are the state police, and you, man, and the people is open, a half a month down while they made the bone. Yes, Anambra State is home of saboteurs. Now, I don't support kidnapping of any type. Please get my read my lips. I don't support kidnapping of any type. But when you are talking about kidnapping, Ikenga is the kidnapper. Yes. On two occasions, or on three occasions since I started this, people have linked kidnapping to Ikenga. First one, second one. I don't think, let I have you still check. First one, second one. 
if I get it correctly, people have linked kidnapping, especially in Imo State, to Ikenga Uruago. To Ikenga Uruago. And according to the man that was giving details, if you listen to the man's detail, you will hear the names that he is mentioning. Nde Megoro, ya, Ikengu Uru Agosti, Megoro, Ticha, Napo Ego, Manda, Napo Rondo. Which Ikenga is not coming on his platform to say it. Now he is here telling you people, oh, now nah, some people, uh, now nah, some, uh, some state, you are any Anambra state, no, maybe, but you are from Imo state, are you not from Imo? Are you not Mbise? Go and ask your forefathers now. Also, Kahabara rest and ago. You are from Mbise. You we are driven out of Mbise because Unu Jintu Bokasicha Otelocha di Leno Lambise. Boys in our rush is hip and pass. Mbise people, very great kingdom. Very great kingdom. Galabam noko everywhere. Pashali, ha, eshi kwe mbise. Galabam no everywhere. Pashali. Pashali. Esi mbise. You may not understand. Mbise people, drive your people. And your people rested in Uru Agunnewe. Did you stop? The answer is no. You started the hip-hop issue. Hip-hop issue. And the man no no Uru Agun. Rush of and pass. And you are saying kidnapping, criminality. First, they will bring you to book because you are one of the kidnappers. And you are saying every other tribe. Let me tell you people what you don't know. Anambra State is where I was born. Married in Anambra. Raised children in Anambra. Yes. So partially, I am an Anambarian. I was born, I spent all my life in Anambra. And then moved to Lagos. Before I traveled to December, I stopped in Anambra. Sleep in Anambara, then go to my village, relocate back to Anambara. So Anambara State is my home. But that would with that being said, talking about no when Ndi see other states. When you get to Anambara State, the most brutal set of people are Anambarians. Nda Anambara. Oh ha Sabo Hamachi. Ilo Aburu. Ilio Munne Hanando Hamachi. I can mention to you many commanders that are under DOS, Vunda Nambara, kidnapping and snatching motors from their own people. Many in the Aburus. They are under Nambara. Mandi Pito Bichi Potarambaha. Mandi Solugo Chipotara. Mando Biano Chipotara. Are they from uh, a, a, a boy state? Ndoshi. Untari Bonde boy. Are they from a boy? Are they from Imo? Are they not from Anambara? Are they not from Anambara? Manda Goloni Le Naru Naru. Abruni, if you do not pay the money, they will then kujishie goko. Are they from? Uh, are they from? Uh, 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 Ebony State, are they from Imo State? Are they not from Anambara? What about Ndogosi? I don't want to call them because I know all of them. Most at times, I don't dine and wine with some of you. The hefty, hefty Aburos in Anambara. So I know all of them. Are they from Ebony? Uh, uh, Na this thing, are they from Anambara? Sapele, uh, Sapele, okay, it's a couple of aha. Mpobaha. It won't go for you now. Mwari kick, but I give mother ten and last threat. But they are watching this very program. And most of them, anyway, 
let me reserve their names for reasons best known to me. On us, Sapelenko. Sapele, who house Sapele? Sapele, who house Sapele? It is an Anambara man that brought him in. I don't want to call them. You people should not force me. Kampoaha. Ebe Sapele, he is on a, on a obosi. Mbora ga honye mwe bone hi. Mbora ga handi ne shelter. Did the number said that they are not the ones that brought Sapele? Is Sapele even working for himself? Sapele is still a slave working under an number state man. So it is nda number ne use him in your name. Do you think that Sapele is working for himself? Sapele work under an number state man. And if I call one of them, one of them is actually a small boy. Who this boy, Gaha Mana, you will you will say get out, but you will not know that he is who and who in Anambara in terms of criminality. Up assigned by the government. Sapele Bez in Anambara work for Anambara state people. Anambara. He he is housed by Anambara. Yeah, I'm telling you now, it is still kidnapping. It is still kidnapping. It's kidnapping. They are the ones. I, I tell you that I know them now. I know them, even the guy housing Sapele in Anambara na Obosi. I know that when they watch me and hear it, he will run away because the guy watch all my programs. I blocked him the first time when he commented one certain time. The time that I was in Nigeria threatening to get hold of me because he knows my house. I block him. He then opened another one and then used it to watch me. I then see his picture and block it again. He is now watching with fake accounts. He is now watching with fake accounts. So I know what I'm saying. You don't tell me what I know better than you. Sapele work for Ndanambara. Ndanambara, the same Ndanambara. So show me the people. Show me the people that they are talking about. That doesn't work for Ndanambara. All of them work for Ndanambara. So Ikenga is saying, I tell me all those people, uh -huh. it is Anambara people that are using them. I am partially from Anambara. Oh. Anambara, the only investment they, they are bringing to you. Do you hear what this Okoko is saying? These are uh, the people fighting for Biafra before, telling you, oh, we are fighting for Biafra. Did you hear the nonsense coming out of his mouth? That is the first investment that they are giving to the people of Biafra. Show me the reason why criminality will not be a top notch. 
When you come to a place, there is no company. There is too many hotels. Where do you want people to get money to lodge in the hotel? You want them to go into robbery. They will go and rob. Rob people. In order to be able to lodge in a hotel. I, I entered um, a wedding one certain time. I pass about how many streets? Those streets are typically hotel from A to Z. Hotel. From A to Z. Barely you can see a house in, the, in those streets. And I started wondering. I was asking the person taking me around. I was asking the person. The person was even telling me that on Fridays, if you do not book hotel on time, before you come on Friday, the hotels are filled up. There will be no vacants. So what do you call this? The government-sponsored agenda of criminality. Now, let me go. Ikenga saying criminal, criminal. The government that Ikenga is supporting, how much is their minimum wage? The minimum wage of the government Ikenga is supporting, which is Nigerian government now, after calling Simon Epa a Nigerian agent. He has turned out uh, to be a Nigerian agent. Colin Simon, a, a APC man, he has turned out to be an APC, protecting APC. And now he is blocking his comment section. He is blocking his comment section. Now, what is the minimum wage of government of Nigeria? Please, can anyone remind me? I had to speak without fact. But the minimum wage is not up to a bag of rice. A, bog, a bag of rice. So what is the government of Nigeria telling the people to go into? Criminal. Forget the fact that the Nigerian government is saying, oh, arrest criminals, arrest criminals. The sole sponsors of criminals are Nigerian government. How can you be paying somebody amount that is not up to buying a bag of rice? And the person have family. Every family man knows if you have children very well, you know that one bag of rice every month. No, 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 no. It depends on the rice. The one that I bought, I bought rice two weeks ago. I bought it 80,000 naira. 80,000 naira. It depends on the rice. There are the ones of 50,000. Unless the price have fallen. But I will go and check. I bought rice recently. Three bags of rice, and I bought one, 80, one, 80. One, 80, one, 80. I bought the rice through blessings. Someone actually sent that to, to help people. 180, 180. 180. So, the, how much is the minimum wage? That is the thing that I'm asking you people. It's not up to one bag of rice. So, what is the government that Ikenga is now supporting? Ikenga is supporting government to come criminality. We are as a real sense, the government is the one sponsoring the criminality. It's not up to one bag of rice. So somebody that cannot uh -oh, take care of his family, what, did, what is the government telling the person to do? To go out and steal? Who is the Ikenga supporting? Those political criminals, Ravajin Ali, they are the main people pushing the criminality and the sponsors of criminality in Ali. So when he runs to support them and he comes to shout to you, look at they are kidnapping people. How can they not kidnap people when your government is not paying them the amount that they're supposed to use to take care of their family? Everybody that you see in Nigeria, if you're a policeman, you're a criminal. If you're a military, you're a criminal. If you cannot survive by giving your uh, arms to criminal to rob, either you, you are robbing by your own self. All of them are criminals. That is the reason why unknown governments are many. Let me tell you what happened in Aaron D. Zorgo. These criminals that he can get supported, the DOS, that send him to do what he's doing today. Do you know what they were doing in Aaron D. Zorgo? When they catch you, they put 500,000 on you. Or else they will show gun in your face and say that you're unknown government. 
they will show gun in your face and say that you are non government and the army catches okay minimum wage now is 65,000 naira according to as of Franklin and bag of rice is 80,000 naira do you get the point the cost of living if you have a family standard every day if you do not spend manageably you must spend 12,000 per day manageably if you have a family if you have a family manageably then those that can bear hunger hunger strike eat once in a day can manage more than uh, not less than 120,000 and the minimum wage is 65,000 so what do you then tell them to do if they have girls their girls should engage in prostitution in order to get money is that not what? That is what Ikenga is supporting. I'm coming out here to tell you rubbish. Coming out here to go ask some money, a hungry, sheepish looking individual, somebody without conscience. And you will see the people that the government that Ikenga is supporting is bringing evil and hardship to their name. You will see them supporting Ikenga and saying, oh, imagine it. Imagine well done. Oko oko leku ihu ihu kadaka. Okay, look at Chicas and Chica said they are still debating the sixty-five thousand. Not all states have agreed to pay sixty-five thousand. Not all states. The kidnapping in Ihiala. Benjamin Madubugu have hand they need. Read my lips. Ndi here I should go and look for Benjamin Madubugu. He have hand in the kidnapping in Ihiala. Read my lips. Let me go on, please. Unya no ebo poro mazen nam de kano nyoshi. Apart from, oh, the reason why I'm fighting Simon, when the government contracted him, he started looking for your sympathy. The same way he blocked his comment section. That was the way he blocked his comment section when he was attacking Simon. And only open it when he see that Somumu Okoko are now supporting him. He opened it. That is what he has started to confuse you. Um, we, we, lo and behold, you will go and tell him Machineke. You are speaking the truth. Machine, Ride on. As they continue telling, Ijele lied on, Ijele lied on, Ijele lied on, Ijele lied on, Ijele went inside. And there is what something that Ikenga said, and I have to say it. Um, Mandi Zion, let me tell you people the truth. Ebukobi have to come out clearly and tell us what is happening in Igbo land. If he is into church, Ebukobi should tell us. If he is into kidnapping, Ebukobi should tell us. Ebukobi and Zion ministry must come out clearly to tell us what is happening in Igbo land. There is something that he said. He said Ebukobi advised him. Which led to him where he is today. Which led to where he is betraying our people. Which led. There are too many meanings in what Ikenga said. Remember, and I never forget how he came to support Hope Uzodema. And we open it. He then denied in what he said openly. I do not look. This is through Views TV. Imanai Remigius TV. I do not care whom you are. If you like, have 100 lawyers threatening people. Every empire in the world have crumbled. I don't buy. You see this deceit. Even watching Eke in a church. Even where when soon as people will be praising you, watching Eke, watching Eke, not knowing that you are the person killing them. Ebuko Kenga said that you are the person that brought him to what he is doing today. And you have some critical questions to answer. Please.
I'm saying it here now and desire no. Until no nothing can happen. Whatever they do, no way. Chineke, 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 chineke. There is no God that will save you anywhere unless you save yourself. God has given you that power to save yourself. And if you support the Nigerian government, you are in for a shock. You know, when I talk about you people, you don't share my videos. I don't care. Don't share, but I will preach that raw truth here. That truth which you people are afraid of. Truth which you people are afraid of. If Obukobi's hand is not what in Ijele speak, I mean, Asumi Ijele, Kezia Haya, Obonturu Ago said, Obonturu Ago said that Obukobi, Obukobi, he started praising you and said that you, he had meetings with you prior to his stand. You must come out to tell us what you discussed with Obonturu Ago. You know all of you, the criminal pastors, and a medi bianima, and a me church in Azu. You people must come out stand. That is the reason why your people have lawyers everywhere. Ekuto oku no ewere lawyer. Chuarivo nya chileke oku no oku. Ina me church. You are giving people hope. In the name of Jesus, they will get cured. But in the name of Jesus, you don't want to. Pursue your own case with the name of Jesus. You are pursuing your case with the name of lawyers and the name of Nigerian government. You don't need law. I don't care who is supporting him. He must come out to, to defend what he can Guru Ago said. I am Onyebu Chiepa. Please. Do you know whom the, he is talking to? He is talking to Mazen Namdekano. Ndasi Zoo Police, Zoo Army. You understand where the word originated from? Zoo Police and Zoo Army. Nage Pachikwe Hankete. No one is your Shihanezu. These are the people. Now, Nigerian police killed NSAS protesters. It is open. Even Lagos State Government paid 100 million to dispose the corpse of those who were killed during the NSAS. Lagos State Government paid money to dispose their dead bodies. Is that not true? Now, Ikenga said, Bachikwa Hankete. The same people who killed and led this musician outside. She escaped outside. And Nkon Borotinumbu. Nkon Borotinumbu said that even the people living a life must be arrested. Even those living a life must be arrested. Those people that protested living a life and escaped death must be arrested. To know what they were doing at Lake Togate. Nigerian police, Nigerian military killed innocent, unarmed. Nigerian police killed innocent, unarmed civilians. Nigerian army killed innocent, unarmed civilians simply because they protest for Biafra. They murdered them, they killed them. So Chibu Zeguato is now telling you that those people that we are killed by Nigerian police, Nigerian army, but we are there using gun when they killed them. The answer is no. 
upon to Uru Ago, Chibuze Guato, said that you should bash him and get him. The same person who alleged uh, when he started that the reason why he was attacking Simon is that because Simon is working with Nigerian police and Nigerian army, Nigerian government. When he started, go and watch the video. He said that it was because he knew that Simon is a Nigerian agent working with Nigerian security agencies and they are the ones that kidnap Onyendu. So Ikenga knew that he was lying to you people all along. Somebody shamelessly that can lie to deceive you. And more through to God that Simon is a Nigerian agent. Today Ikenga is the Nigerian agent. Can you take this person serious? Is this person serious, worthy to be among human? Ikenga Uruagu supported the killing of innocent Biafra people. Today he is getting the shock of his own life. Thank you for saying that you watch the program. But you people must not be watching his programs, please. It was people that used to send to me in Yona Akoeri. Don't watch. Unless he unlock his, uh, his, uh, his uh, distance. Don't watch. This is how Ijele Speak started. He blocked his comment section. Come and talk rubbish and go. When they have buy your sympathy, they will unlock. Then you will then become, hey, he hate bring it before, but now I am seeing that you are saying the truth. They will confuse you. The same way they confused you and lied to you. That Simon is a Nigerian agent. That is the same way he will lie to you. And buy your sympathy. Then he will say, a use you. Every, every criminal that comes out use you people. Tell Ikenga. What happens when he was threatening and saying that Nigerian police, Nigerian army is spying innocent people? Showing you the videos of the massacre which was done by Nigerian police and Nigerian army. At a time, one day he came looking as if he was crying, saying, oh, the impunity is too much. We cannot continue like this. Through to God, who made me and you? Nigerian police and Nigerian army, you cannot buy all of us finish. We will. Is this not the same Ikenga? To show you that Agon uh, Dianaho. Lo and behold, what happened to the people? To the people. There, there must be a time that he will serve the money that they are giving you now. Because there must be a time that you will regret yourself. Even them will lock you up. I'm telling you the right truth now. He tell a speak. It's not even. It is Feb Kobe that arrested him. Quite all right. But many powers are at the back of Abu Kobi saying that he should rot in jail. Many governors are at the back of Abu Kobi. They don't want to confront. Many senators, many here. So Ikenga coming out. Eh? Asami <laughs> Ikenga. Udele. Udele coming out. Udele coming out will be a thing of all. Ha na se na o o de develop o na kidney na 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 area si kidney problem na na chain one there is borrow pit in every every prison that is one thing that you must know Nigerian government put borrow pit in every prison I am a man of oremijus. You see this thing now that Ikenge is saying that uh, he is now a CID. 
video somebody and send to him. This is another money making machine. Once you video and send to Ikenga, Ikenga will then collect money from the person and tell him, you need to or else they will come. He, he did it in Imo State now. He did it in Imo State. Anybody that uh, you hurt uh, now, it is money making machine. He can have now opened another office. Video. He will call the person, eh, they have reported you to me. Eh, they will send some people to go and bring the person. And they will say, if you do not bail yourself, because the people that came, came, eh, go if you do not bail yourself, we will take you. We will report you. We will take you to Anambra State. This is the Kenga CID. And you have to bail yourself with 100,000, 200, 500 as they do in Imo State. As they do in Imo State. Have you now heard that Ikenga is now a CID? Buying our people. <laughs> Hi. Oh, yeah, yeah. Since he went to police, as a bond, I'm a police. Since he went to police, as a what made him to join IPOB? Ask him. Is the land good before you join IPOB? It was the kidnapping of our innocent people. Roadblocks everywhere. Buying everywhere. Do you remember when they buy somebody in Anambra State? Only in Anya Tipa. On countless occasion. Even the one that they use to plank and buy by Soludo people. At the back of Coke. Had the plank pegged the person. Piabuoya. When we are they are collecting money from the person. So when the government for people to join IPOB it is because of the Evil perpetrated by government, not even by criminals, by government themselves. That was the reason why people joined IPOB and said enough of this shit. Enough of this evil. Today the government is sponsoring criminals by paying them less. The cost of living in Igoncha, in Nigeria, you can buy it 600, 700. And your payment is not up to 2,000 per day. So let's assume me so I put no 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 we two soap you have spent one thousand two hundred new to turn up a idea toothbrush turn up a idea toilet is turn up a idea oh my sanitary pad is not there monthly sanitary pad is not there children baby pad is not there so what is the government of Nigeria asking you to do go into criminal go into robbery. That is what Opantu, Chibuz, or Eguato have come to defend. Opantu, Chibuz, or Eguato have come to defend. They have come to defend. Now, we have a Sege, now, but if we have a Kete, and a Sege, and we have a Zoo Police, Zoo Army. Now, listen and hear what he will say that will happen to me as in Namdekano. He is coming. He is not mentioning his name, but Manonyo na Goku. Okay. It is because of the poverty in Nigeria. That was the reason why Ikenga was in Nigeria. And that what so much my wonderful viewers for watching this video together with me from the beginning to the end like i said before if you like what you see here if you like what i do in this platform as you have finished watching this video please hit that red button that says subscribe and put on your notification bell to all notifications in that way you'll be able to know when i upload a new video share my videos leave your comments in the comment section constructively until I meet your way again in my next video, I still remain your Linda's TV show.
Bye-bye.